My name is Kent Honda. I'm an ordinary high school student. I wish I could say that, but I've already quit school because I have a very special circumstance. Now the next payment day is at the end of next month, okay? Yes, I understand. That's right. The special circumstance is actually a huge debt. The debt originally belonged to my father, who liked to gamble, but he disappeared all of a sudden, leaving me and my mother behind. My mother was physically weak to begin with, and I guess this incident shocked her so much that she got even sicker. She had to quit her teaching job, so she can't even work to pay off the debt. I'm sorry, Kent. It's okay. We can make it if it's just the monthly payments. If only I hadn't been his guarantor. It's not your fault, but his. You can stay in bed. But we can't keep living like this. It'll be fine. Of course, I don't have any resentment toward my mother, and I don't plan on leaving her alone. However, it's true that we have to do something about the situation. I'm only paying off the interest with the monthly payments. If we keep going like this... Huh? What's this? Let's see... Human auction. We'll buy you at a high price. What's this? It sounds fishy. Is this a prank or a scam? That advertisement had a QR code. It seemed like I could check the details on the internet. Usually I would laugh off such an advertisement, but I'm currently in a desperate situation. Well, I guess I'll just sign up. Even if this was a scam, since I don't have a credit card, I don't have any information that could be stolen. I won't be in a worse situation than I am now. As soon as I got home, I signed up and entered my personal information. Most of the questions were about physical info and personal preferences, which made it rather creepy. My favorite snack, list of dishes I want my girlfriend to make, what I want to do now and my future dream? Do they really need all this information? I feel like I'm really going to be evaluated. That's it. Well, it's probably a prank but I gotta kill some time. I'm gonna go take a bath. Wow, what? What is it? Huh? What is this? It says, you have been sold successfully, and my price was 100 million yen. Th th this has gotta be a prank, right? H hey, 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 no way. You must be Mr. Kent Honda. Y yes the ownership right of yourself has been transferred to Ms. Mary Toyota as of now. Is there a chance that the auction was real? Yes, it's all real. You have been bid on. Kent, who are they? M Mom! If I've been sold successfully, I'll really get 100 million yen in my hand. Then I can pay back the debt. Now, this way. Kent? Don't worry about me. And we should get a lot of money, so please pay back the debt with that money. Where are you going, Kent? I'm not sure, but once I get settled, I'll contact you. And just like that, it seems like I'll be owned by this person named Mary Toyota. I wonder what kind of person she is, and how will I be treated? The moment I was escorted into a car, reality hit me, and I got terrified all of a sudden. However, there's no place for me to escape. There was nothing I could do, and the car arrived at a great house that looked like a mansion. The person who was standing there to welcome me was a cute girl, about the same age as I was. Thank you for coming here, Mr. Kent. Sure, sure. I'm Mary Toyota. Toyota? Does that mean you're the one who bought me? Yes. As of today, you belong to me. I was imagining a more elegant person who spends all her day just enjoying her pastime. Who in the world is this girl? <laughs> you look like you're wondering about me. Th that's right. Everything happened so quickly. Then let's go to my room. I'll explain it to you. Sh sure. Phew! We should be fine here. Huh? What do you mean? <sighs> this is too precious! What? do you mean? Oh, I'm happy we're in the same room and breathing the same air. Her mood has changed completely. Oh, sorry. This is the real me. Oh, okay. Hey, Kent. 
Don't be so polite. Treat me like your girlfriend. Wait, Miss Toyota? I want you to call me Mary. Wait, what's going on? But since I've been bought, I guess I have to obey her commands. Um, Mary? Well, please explain. Oh, then let me explain everything. I'm actually the daughter of a company's president. Okay. Have you heard of the Toyota Corporation? What? Toyota? Toyota as in that Toyota Corporation? It's a big global company. <laughs> That's right! So that's how I could pay $100 million in one bid! I see. But why did you buy me? That's easy! Because I've liked you for a long, long time! Huh? But this is our first time meeting each other, right? Well, what do you think? No, this has to be the first time. There's no way I'd forget such a cute girl. And you know, since I like you, I created an auction website just for you and put the advertisement in the mailbox. The rest is just as you know it. It means everything was set up to buy me. Oh, what about the debt? What's going to happen to my mom? There's no need to worry. Everything is set up so you'll be happy. But it took me more time for preparation than I first planned. I'm sorry. I meant to help you out earlier. No, it's not something you need to apologize for. Rather, I'm not sure about the details, but I appreciate it. You're so kind. That's what I like about you. Mary, you're too close. What? You're mine, so there's nothing wrong with this. And this is how my surprising new life started. I was imagining being forced to do harsh labor and such, but my role was focused on interacting with Mary. In fact, I'm not sure what kind of powers were at work, but I got to enter the same high school as Mary. <laughs> I'm glad we're in the same class. I guess you paid a lot of money under the table, right? You would give other people the wrong idea. I gave them some land, not money. I knew it. You're very guilty. Don't be so picky. You didn't want to quit school, right? How did you know that? <laughs> I know all your personal information. Oh, from the auction. No wonder they've been serving me my favorite food. Mm -hmm. What's wrong? Well, I'm not sure how to explain it, but I feel perplexed to be treated so nicely all of a sudden. Are you troubled by any chance? Oh, no. I'm not troubled by any means, but I've had such a hard time. Yeah, I know, I know. So you can have a lot of happy moments from now on. Why do you care so much about me, Mary? Oh, I guess I never told you. A little while ago, I heard you helped my grandma. I did? Yes. So I started doing some research about you so I could return the favor. And I found out about your debt. I was surprised because you acted so kindly to others, even though you were in such a difficult situation. Isn't that normal? When you have a lot on your plate, it's hard to think about other people. Is that so? Yes, that's why I came to like you. It's been a while since we got together and you're just as I expected you to be. I, I feel embarrassed. Here, let's go to school quickly. Okay. I can't remember how long it has been since I was in a class last. I feel a little nervous because it's been a while. Hello there, I'm Miss Honda, and I'll be your teacher from today. I hope we can have a great year. Huh? Mom, why? And are you feeling okay? Oh yeah, I feel so much better. This is all thanks to Miss Toyota. Thank you very much. Oh no, Mom, don't be such a stranger, please. You guys are strangers, but... I'm so happy. My mom is feeling better. It's like a dream coming true. Man, you could have told me that you hired my mom. I thought it'd be a nice surprise. And I have one more surprise. What? What is it? I is this voice Kent? Oh, no way. It's the person who used to be your father. He's running away from different debt collectors. 
Phew, it was hard to find him. Because of it, I was late to help you out. Right now, he's caught by the men I've hired. Do you want to help him out? Th that Help me, Kent. They're telling me that they'll turn me into the loan shark, depending on your answer. But you racked up all the debt, right? That's right. But there's no way I can pay so much interest. Hey, help me out, Kent. Otherwise, I'm not sure what's going to happen to me. Sorry, Mary. I'm not truly a good person. Is it hard to forgive him? Yeah, it is. I can't forgive a person who betrayed my mom. I see. Mary said she liked me because I was kind. Since I showed my dark side, probably... I got it! Good job, Kent! M mary Why? Huh? What do you mean? I'm not kind at all. Being kind and being gullible are totally different things. Your decision is only natural, and I do the same thing. Well, I don't dislike gullible people, though. Okay. I'm glad to hear that. I was worried how you'd feel about me. Oh? Uh, were you worried that I wouldn't like you? Huh? That's not what it is. Aw, you're so cute. Don't worry. I love you, Kent. Just like that, I got a clean slate and started a new life. My mother got better, and I'm having a great time with Mary every day. Thank you for watching again. It would make me so happy if we could watch another rom-com story together. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. See you next time. Bye!